Hey, man, I just want to say this. If you're a Florida State fan right now, I know y'all have to be shocked, flabbergasted, and just downright disgusted with what y'all just seen on that damn football field. Y'all need Uncle Lou and y'all need White Tonto to go down there to Tallahassee, dig up those Native American skeletons and bones, and see if y'all can send some smoke signals to Mike Norvell, the so-called head football coach of the Florida State White Tontos or the Seminoles or the um smoke signalers because memphis just whooped y'all ass man that was the better team in this damn game dj ungle four flat tires this kid has he is the true original qb journeyman he is the true originator of the definition journeyman he is a certified journeyman he was better off staying at oregon state and being the starting quarterback there he has not done nothing to get the florida state fans excited about him being the head quarterback of the florida state white tontos now final score in this game memphis versus you know uh, florida state 20 memphis um measly ass florida state 12 they tried to throw up a measly ass hail mary you know the florida um state offense looked like um doodoo smelling like doodoo acting like doodoo and just straight doodoo this shit is typical of florida state they still haven't gotten over their ass whooping my georgia bulldogs gave them last uh, football season one of the most devastating ass whoopings in college football bowl game history and this momentum has not led up to them even winning one game they lost their first game they lost their second game to boston college then they lose today to memphis a group of um a group of five teams so you know memphis might have a chance to um make the playoffs 12 team playoffs but we already know who's not going to be there and we already know that the ACC is wide open for you know teams like you know um Miami you know Georgia Tech well I can't even name you any other significant team in the ACC that could actually do something because you know Notre Dame they're not even in a fucking conference and besides that they lost the NIU last week so you know they're not making the playoffs anyway but you know Mike Norvell he needed his ass whooped He's supposed to be this big ass uh, QB guru who knows what he's doing with quarterbacks at the quarterback position, but he is not really doing his job right. And I don't know who else they're gonna um get as the head football coach for the Florida State Seminoles. Hell, hell, they might need to go back and get um Steve Urkel, Willie Taggart. But besides that, man, I just wanted to report on <laughs> this situation because it is you know funny as hell. This is the first on three start for I think the Florida State um White Tontos aka the Florida State Seminoles, since the, I think the 1950s or the 1970s. So, you know, this is a very bad look on the university. The um, fans have given up on the team. The team members have definitely gave up on the Florida State baby Seminoles, the white Tontos. They don't give a fuck about Florida State. Most of these kids coming in from the transfer portal. You know, the um, state of Florida is wide open. You know, Miami might be the best team in Florida because Florida is a middle-of-the-road team. You know, they don't have no quarterback. Besides some nigga bro named DJ Lagway. But besides that, um, we'll have to see where this goes um throughout the whole season for um Florida State. We'll see if they're gonna be bowl eligible like Colorado, because you know they're struggling and trying to win games too. They lost to Nebraska last week, you know, after talking all that shit. But besides that, um that this all I wanted to report on tonight, Georgia versus Kentucky. We about to um whoop on some wildcats. No, we will not be eating them. We would just be going in there, giving them the annual ass whooping. They haven't beaten us since, you know, 2009. So besides that, most likely if I don't fall asleep and go into a coma slash hibernation or just go to sleep because, you know, I'm 30 years old, I'm old. But besides that, I might do um live stream commentary on the game. If not, um I just do like a play-by-play um, follow-up um, tomorrow most likely. But besides that, shout out to all the Florida State fans, the ones who haven't um been in the corner crying all day or the first game of the season when they got their ass whooped. So besides that, um the ACC is wide open. We'll know if Clemson is gonna improve. Um Florida State won't know what they're gonna do because their season's already over with. So hopefully they can win six games to get to a mediocre bowl game. Maybe the Tostillos Bowl, maybe the um Lumberjack Bowl, you know, the um Kellogg's uh, Cornflakes Bowl. Maybe to um get a quarterback from the transfer port portal bowl or just put me out of my misery bowl. But besides that, thank y'all for looking at the video. And if you're a Florida State fan in the comment section, tell me what y'all think y'all can do to improve y'all team from sending smoke signals and just 
you know, um, throwing bow and arrows at each other and just putting, you know, fake edges on top of horses. 